After Deontay Wilder's devastating loss to Joseph Parker, Eddie Hearn has stated that Anthony Joshua will now most likely face Philip Hergovic for the vacant IBF heavyweight world title. At the day of reckoning, the British boxer made a statement by halting the Swede at the conclusion of the fifth round in a commanding performance in Saudi Arabia. Joshua and Wilder were scheduled for a high-profile fight, but the American fighter could not live up to the expectations placed on him when he was defeated by Joseph Parker, who prevailed in all 12 rounds of their heavyweight bout. Hearn said, we signed for Wilder, he lost tonight, according to Talk Sport, confirming that arrangements for the highly anticipated matchup had been derailed by Wilder's loss. Given that AJ's goal is to win the heavyweight title three times, perhaps it is a blessing. AJ and Hergovic will face off for the world championship. The bizarre turn of events coincides with remarks made by Joshua following his victory, in which he seemed to imply that the long-rumored two-fight contract would still go through. Josh said, I wasn't watching, when asked about his response to Wilder's defeat. I was only thinking about myself. So what if Deontay lost? I heard, he'll return. I'll go for the higher ground, and I'm hoping he returns. Joshua then asked the question of the fans present, to which he got a mediocre answer that raised more questions about the possibility of a battle between the two. Pergovic made an appearance on the Day of Reckoning undercard and quickly eliminated Mark D. Mori in Saudi Arabia, finishing the fight in a matter of minutes. The 31-year-old has a stellar 17-0 record, winning 14 of his fights by Nako. For his part, the British fighter's victory marked his third straight victory following two losses to Oleksandr Yusik. From the start of the fight, the 34-year-old was aggressive, and by the conclusion of the fifth round, he put more pressure on his Swedish opponent, who started to appear jaded. Referee Steve Gray was notified by Wallen's corner that the 33-year-old was not able to continue, and Joshua won by a technical knockout, ending his opponent's six-match winning streak. Speaking following the fight, Joshua was forced to respond to inquiries about the highly anticipated rematch with Tyson Fury. In response to the question of who he would rather face next the Jepsi King or the Croatian, he declared, I'll fight Tyson Fury 100%. However, I won't be avoiding Hergovic. I'll be fighting Fury too.